Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Uh, thanks for joining me again. Uh, firstly, I'd just like to say thank you very much to everyone who's watched and supported my uh, recent videos. Over 400 views on my uh, my latest one on Adam Kenway's uh, Everesting Attempt. So that's pretty good. Um, that's the most views I've had on a video so far. It might not seem like much, but uh, yeah, support's uh, really appreciated. I'm learning a bit more about YouTube and how to edit videos, so it's uh, yeah, keeping me busy whilst uh, there's a period of no racing. Obviously, it's disappointing that we're not racing, but obviously in the circumstances, it's uh, good to kind of learn something new. So I'm enjoying uh, filming and editing my videos for you guys. And if you do enjoy these videos, please do like and subscribe because uh, that's a great help. So yeah, we'll get on with the ride today. I've got a two hour loop planned. I uh, found a little sheltered spot here as it's pretty windy out there. Um, so we're just going to head out into the wind. It's a bit of a northwesterly wind today, so I think we're going to head over to Nutsford. Tatton Park has reopened in the last couple of days, I think. So we'll head out there and uh, hopefully get a tailwind back. It's raining. Pretty sure we're at its best, you know. So I've already failed at avoiding the rain, but as I say, I'm going to take you out for a nice little loop of my. Uh, New local training roads, I suppose you could say. I've been uh, over here in the UK since the lockdown began. Um, unable to get back to the Isle of Man at the moment due to the borders being closed. So yeah, just kind of exploring some new roads here at the moment, uh, which I'm really enjoying actually. Um, obviously it's not home, but the good news from home is they have had new, no new cases of coronavirus in I think 13 days now. So. I think that's the most important thing is to uh, kind of keep the virus out and keep the the mouse people safe. So for me, I'm just staying here in the UK for the moment until uh, obviously circumstances change or uh, I'm, I'm able to get back and self-isolate. So with the strong winds this morning and a little bit of rain in the air, I've gone for a bit of an aero slash waterproof combination with my uh, Leemar airspeed helmet on my noggin and some Velotech over, over shoes that are aero and pretty waterproof on my feet so yeah that should keep me nice and dry what a difference a week makes in weather last week shorts and jersey this week gabba jacket over shoes long sleeve base layer just to say reasonably warm back to reality a little bit after the last couple of weeks of weather we've had um, but today just going to take you on a little two hour loop obviously the weather's not great but we'll do our best to show you some nice little spots in Cheshire here so I'm actually inside the tunnel now that goes underneath Manchester airport it's probably quite dark on the lens now but yeah nice little sheltered spot in here because it's pretty windy out there um, I've been trying to dodge the rain and the wind all morning through the lanes but to be honest I think the best bet is just find a tunnel and ride up and down it there's no GPS like but you'll be alright you stay dry and there's not much wind in here so that's my that's my top tip for riding in the wind and rain so as I said a little earlier in the video I'm gonna head over to Nutsford and Tatton Park today it's been closed for the last few weeks so I've not done this loop in a little while, but yeah, it's always a nice little loop. Get to ride through the park, see all the deer and that. We're in Tatton Park now. As you can see, it's pretty nice through here. That's why I like to ride through. There's usually not much traffic in here either, so that's always uh, always nice. So just come out of Tatton Park now. It's pretty much the halfway point of the ride. I'm looking forward to a bit of a tailwind home now. So just while I'm stopped here, I just thought I'd tell you a little bit about an event that's going on back home. Uh, next Friday, on the 12th of June, 
which would have been senior race day of the Alaman TT, which is obviously one of the biggest events that the Alaman hosts. Um, but in place of that, there's been an event organised uh, with the help of Jeff the Mongoose in aid of the Manx Solidarity Fund. Obviously, people from the Alaman will have seen the great work Christian Varley did a couple of weeks ago, running 19 marathons in 19 days. But this event's a little different, not the TT. Six motorbike riders and six Manx cyclists teaming up to uh, yeah raise money for the Manx Solidarity Fund. Obviously, it's a great cause. And uh, I'll drop the link in the description below so you can check out more details on the event. And please, if you can, do consider making a donation to the Manx Solidarity Fund. They're doing an amazing job of helping people out in need at the moment. And uh, yeah, I just thought I'd give a little bit of a shout out to them for doing such a great job. And uh, yeah, if you can, like I say, please do donate to the fund because it helps greatly, I'm sure. <laughs> couple of weeks uh, which will probably be around a 200k mark I'll keep you posted on them if you do want to see them don't forget to subscribe uh, the easiest way to do that is you can see in the bottom corner just down there my head poking up in the corner of the screen if you hover over that then you'll be able to click that subscribe button to uh, keep updated with what I'm up to Ferrari or something going through there but not today um, so yeah up the final little climb here up Wizard Hill and then down all downhill into Macclesfield and home so that's the last little climb done just heading past Hare Hill now on these nice little lanes uh, down into Presbury and then back so thanks for joining me on this little adventure down my new local roads I will be doing some more exciting rides in the next couple of weeks hopefully the weather will improve for them and I've got a few new bits coming for that as well so yeah stay tuned for that um, and if you did enjoy this video then please do like and subscribe you can do that down below and I hope to see you out on the road soon but for now stay safe and I'll see you later